One for one then. It's still on. Seven of the best. Eight of the best. Nine. Yes, he's done it. And a first. Sir. He promised to know his daughter. The Legend Darts Pro Series V2 Darts Review begins right now. What's up guys, Worldwide here. So we got a great video for you today. Now before we begin, you may be wondering why did I have Adrian Lewis in the thumbnail? Well, let me explain really quick. So I picked these darts up at Darts Corner. Now they have a brand of darts called Legend Darts. Now in that brand, they have a line of darts called Legends Darts. And basically what they've done is make replicas of some of the most popular darts in darting history. So I'm gonna name a few, like they have a, a replica John Lowell, RVB, uh, James Wade, obviously Adrian Lewis as well. So obviously for, you know, probably legal reasons, contractual reasons, they can't use his image or likeness. However, me as a YouTuber, I can pretty much do whatever I want. So uh, yeah, that's why I put his image in the thumbnail. Hey, plus it's good for views, right? So uh, check this out. Yeah, like I said, I got these at Darts Corner. And right now, as of today, 40 US dollars. However, they do have a new website and I guess they had some glitches on the startup a couple weeks ago. So they sent out an email with a 15% off discount code. So if you didn't get, uh, get that email, look into it, maybe check your spam folder. But anyway, I used my discount code on these plus a few other sets of darts. That 15% knocked these down to 34 US dollars. And as you're watching the rest of the video, just keep in mind guys, $34 for this set of darts. Wait till you see how incredible they are. So let's get into the rest of the video. I'm gonna hit you with the stats and dimensions, talk about the grip level. We have some perfect match weight again. So uh, yeah, after all that, I'll get these on the board, throw them for a bit, and I'll give you some feedback on what I think of the Legend Darts Pro Series Model V2. So here we go. Okay, so quick peek at the packaging here. Nothing too fancy, just comes in your typical cardboard hand case. As you see there, the darts were held in this plastic tray that you see there. And as far as the darts themselves, check that out. Classic straight barrel multi-ring design. We've got the Legend Darts nylon stems. Those are an intermediate length, by the way. And we've got the Legend Darts standard size flights. Really nice, 100 microns, by the way. So let's get a little bit closer look and I'll run down all the stats and dimensions. Okay, there you go. And hey, I gotta say for a basic set of barrels, I mean, come on, these things are pretty nice, right? But starting up front, we have a set of silver points. I'm not sure of the total length here. However, they only stick out of the barrel, 26 millimeters. So kind of on the short side there, you will definitely want to repoint these things as soon as you get them. But the barrels themselves, 90% tungsten, the barrel length coming in at 53.2 millimeters long, and the barrel width, get ready for this, six millimeters thin. So kind of on the long side and super thin as well. Now I unscrewed the stem and checked out the drill depth. These are drilled out to a depth of 14.2 millimeters deep. Now the match weighting on this thing, get ready for this guys. Only the third time this has ever happened on this channel and second time as of recent. So let's go into the next clip. Okay, so check this out. This is absolutely incredible. I don't know what's going on, but I've been getting sent some super high quality darts as of recently. Only the third time this has ever happened on the channel. As you see here, these are advertised as 21 grams. The first barrel, spot on, 21.00 grams. The second barrel, 21.00. And I think you know we're going with the third. Come on, 21.00, really? So yeah, all three barrels, perfect match weighting, and it matches up perfectly with the advertised weight as well. Like I said, only the third time this has ever happened on this channel, twice in the last couple of weeks. The other one was with the Corella darts from Germany. So yeah, well done, Legend Darts. That's absolutely amazing. Just the quality, the quality control is on another level. Wow. Okay, so let me describe this barrel for you really quick and then I'll give you a grip rating. So up front, we've got this kind of a blunt nose cone that's followed by 11 wider multi-rings. Then we've got this smooth section right here with the Legend Dart logo. 
And then on the back end here, we have these six machined multi-rings. Now the grip level, I don't know, my hands are really rough this time of the year. I've been in the gym a lot, but not that grippy. I'm going to go ahead and give it a grip level 2.3 on a scale of 1 to 5. Obviously, if your hands are a little bit softer, they might feel a little slightly more grippy. But yeah, overall, pretty mild grip on these things. So here's the deal. I have not thrown these darts yet, so I don't know what setup I'm going to use. Let me go warm up for a bit. And I'm thinking I might put on the condors for the throwing part of the video, but again, not sure. So, um, yeah, let me go warm up for a bit, and we'll see how these things fly. But, yeah, pretty anxious to throw them. Here we go. Okay, just had a quick four or five minute warm up, and check that out. Completely stock. Matter of fact, I've got the Trident 180 nose cones over here. Didn't even bother using them. They're flying well enough, so, hey, we'll just go. 100% stock as they came out of the box. So here we go, five throws with the Legend Arts Pro Series V2. Hey, a little hundred to kick things off with. So I hate to start off the throwing part of the video with something negative, but it's, this is a pet peeve of mine. Obviously, I'm going to have the link down in the pinned comment. It's going to take you over to check these darts out. And I said 21 and 23 grams. They come in. However, these ones, the 21 gram version on the website is listed as 6.3 millimeters wide. That's incorrect. Obviously, you saw this video. These things are 6 millimeters wide. So it's frustrating as a customer or as a dart player. You guys know we're set in our ways, right? So if you order a set of darts expecting 6.3 millimeters and they show up, super thin, you're gonna be disappointed, right? So long story short, let's hope Darts Corner sees this video and corrects, um, yeah, makes or corrects that mistake on their website. As you see though, they're flying, oh, deflection. Hey, now I wonder, had I had those Trident 180 nose cones on, would that dart have slid past the two already in the board? That could have been a 180 instead, 140. Makes you wonder. So yeah, other than that one complaint about the uh, about the website, that's really all I have. Well, the silver points too. Now, as far as my grip, my pointer finger and thumb, right, pretty much in the middle of the barrel, right before that smooth section. Just feels nice right in the middle of the barrel. It's gonna work well for front grippers, middle grippers, but I mean, there's a lot of people that don't like this smooth section, so. You know, kind of work your way around that. Extreme rear grippers, though, on these six multi-rings on the back end. That's perfect as well. I'm not sure where Adrian grips his darts. He's a big dude, so his hand probably takes up most of the dart, doesn't it? But yeah, they're flying really, uh, yeah, really nice, right? Just a great classic barrel at a very affordable price. And hey, that's what we do here on this channel. Great darts don't have to cost a lot of money. Main theme of this channel. Where is that going? There we go, good recovery. Mm, very good recovery. Let me get this one out of the way for you. Look at that, nice little 125, what was that, four throws? Four pretty good throws. So yeah, we'll do one more. Very mild, yeah, like I said, very mild grip on these things. Nothing sharp or anything like that. Yeah, basically just a repointing away from an almost perfect set of darts. Oh no, I really need a third dart saver. Did not come today. I guess we'll have to end with that. Well, anyway, as you saw, though, that was four pretty good turns out of the five there. Just a great set of darts. Again, darts corner. Fix that discrepancy on the website, and hey, we'll be good to go. So uh, a couple more clips. We're going to do the 180. I'm going to give these things a recommendation, and then we're going to do a close-up of the 180 at the end, and that's going to be a wrap. So enjoy these last two clips. Oh, 
Okay, well, there it is, guys. And believe it or not, I've been recording for 45 seconds, 46, 47. I believe that was the second try. I might even include the warm-up throw or the first throw that I did. But, hey, great set of darts. Can't believe how much fun I had with these things. And, uh, again, the price, 40 U.S. dollars. If you happen to have that discount code that they sent out in the email, or keep an eye for future discount codes they might send out in an email. Again, link to Darts Corner down below in the pinned comment. Take you right over to the Legend Darts. You can check out all of the Legend Darts that they have. So now is the time to give these things a rating and how well I think they will work for the average recreational dart player. These things are gonna get a monster score. When you factor in everything, the price, the match weighting, the quality, how easy they are to throw, all day long with a great score. I think this 9.5 is a fair score. It's gonna work, this dart's gonna work well for most players. It comes in 21 and 23 grams. I think 23 grams is right there in the middle. Perfect weight. And again, just everything about these darts is incredible. Obviously, gonna need a repointing. And really the only reason I deducted a couple tenths of a point, 53.2 millimeters, slightly too long for most players. However, easy enough to get used to. So yeah, very worthy of a score of 9.5. So that's it for the video, guys. We're going to do a close-up of that 180 that I just hit. And that's a wrap. So if you enjoyed it, thumbs up. Always appreciated. However, even more, I enjoy the comments. I'd rather have a comment than a thumbs up. So um, yeah, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. And until next time, we'll see you on the next video. Later.